guys if you've been following this channel for a while you know that i'm a huge fan of virtual reality so i couldn't help myself but to get my hands on the new vr headset from oculus the oculus quest a headset that doesn't require any external computer and that can recognize the player movement using mounted camera in this video i will show you how you can make your own oculus quest game in five steps using unity so without first ado let's get started Okay, first step is to set up the Unity project. In the install window, click on add to download a new Unity version. Right now, I strongly recommend using the 2019.1.f1 as Unity has integrated Android support since 2019 and that this version of Unity is not in beta as you can see from the F which means final. But if you are watching this video from the future, every version above this one which are not beta should work with this tutorial. Ok now we will click on next and we will select both the Android build, support and the Android SDK and NDK tools. Click on down and this will download everything for you. Oh and if you have already downloaded this version of Unity, you can add the Android support by clicking on the three little dot over there. Ok perfect, now everything is set up, we can go back to the project windows, click on the little drop down next to the new button and select the version we have just installed. Now select 3D, give a new name to the project, I will name mine Oculus Quest Tutorial and once you're ready, click on create. And here we have it, an empty Unity scene, let's move on to step 2 of the Oculus integration. We will now import in our project the development kit that Oculus has made for us. To do this, go in the asset store window and if you don't see this window, you can go on window, then asset store. Search for Oculus integration and then click on this little pink button to download it. Oh and you might uh, have to restart the Unity editor to update the Oculus plugin during the importation, so be ready. And here we go, it took some time but we now have the Oculus integration inside our project. For the next step we will make the most simple VR game ever. If you are interested in making your own VR game, I've made a complete tutorial series that will teach you all the bases that you need to get started with the Oculus and everything in this series still works with the Oculus Quest. Ok back to our tutorial, as we don't need the main camera we can delete it, I'm going to create a 3D plane and a cube and center their position to 0 0 0. I will add some colors to my scene by creating a red material and drag the material to the cube so that it will have it. Finally, I can search for the OVR player controller inside the project folders and drag this prefab inside the hierarchy to make it appear in the scene. I will move it a bit further from the cube and now we can add ends to our player by searching for the local avatar and dragging it as a child of the tracking space inside the OVR player controller prefab. And voila! Next step is to configure our project to build for Android, which is the platform used by the Oculus Quest. On the top left corner, click on File, then Build Settings. We can click on Add Open Scene to add the current scene to the final application. Next, click on Android on the left and then we will switch the platform to Android by clicking on Switch Platform. Now that we have switched the platform, we have some little settings to do. Click on player settings, scroll to the bottom of the page and you can see that the virtual reality is enabled because we have downloaded the Oculus integration. But it's better to click on the little plus button and add the Oculus as the first element of the SDK list. We have also a warning over there, you can get rid of it by scrolling to other settings and remove Vulkan from the graphics. API oh, and while we are at it, you can set the minimum API level to 4.4 KitKat as Unity require an API level of 19 or higher. And here we go, our project is now set up, I promise. The last step is to configure our well-beloved Oculus Quest to developer device. For that, go in the Oculus app in your phone, click on setting and collect to your quest. Then click on more settings developer and enable the developer mode. Now we can plug our Oculus Quest to the computer using the USB-C cable. 
inside the headset, your Oculus Quest will ask you if you are sure you want to connect to your computer. And I know we should never trust a machine, but go on and click on OK. And there you have it. We can go back to the build settings and click on build and run. Give a name to your Oculus Quest game and it will automatically build it inside the device. Oh, and if you are testing the little scene that uh, I've made earlier, you can see that sometimes the interior of our face is visible. This is a weird bug that Oculus should fix soon, but for now, you can go in the local avatar and uncheck body. Also, if you want to make the controls appear, check the start with controller box. And that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial as much as I enjoy making it. If you want to learn more about VR development, check out those two videos. Also, if you want to support my channel, subscribe and like this video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.